good morning from Fongamata. Mum's walking away. <laughs> <laughs> Try that again. Good morning from Fongamata. <laughs> good morning, guys. Welcome to the Labour Weekend vlog. Yes, we are in Fongamata. It is Saturday and it has been a very slow morning of sport. We didn't get down here last night until half past 11. We had this thing as a family where we don't travel in the daytime. We wait till it gets dark, till the traffic is gone, and then we leave. But last night we didn't leave home till... It must have been like 9 o'clock by the time we left. And then Dad decided that he wanted to charge the car, which didn't actually need charging. So then we stopped to charge the car. And then we finally got down here. I went to bed straight away because I was like falling asleep in the car. And then woke up at 8, had F1 practice... Uh, All Blacks won and they're going to the World Cup final. Here's Dad. Hello. Can you help me? Just the lawnmower, the bits for the lawnmower. Oh. And it is currently F1 qualifying is happening right now, but we're going to go down to the market and come back and watch it, like, delayed. Now that the game's finished, we feel like everyone's going to be going down to the market, so we don't want to, like, miss out. I'm just down here with Mum and Dad. Taya was meant to come, but she is busy doing planning and reports, which... I never appreciated when I was a student how much work teachers put in outside of school hours. When it's school holidays, guys, if you're a student at when it's school holidays, your teachers don't have holidays, okay? So please show your teachers some appreciation because now that I have teacher friends, it is a very time-consuming job. So Taya is not here, unfortunately, which makes me so sad, but Rachel and Morgan are both coming down separately today. Rachel's coming from Hamilton, Morgan's coming from Auckland. They should be on their way now, I think. Matthew and Sage are also coming down to stay with us here tonight. And they'll be down later on this afternoon but the weather's kind of like iffy at the moment but it's meant to be getting better like as the afternoon progresses which is fantastic got a bag would that work yeah that'll work i don't think we're gonna buy that much are we right the girls go into the market all done at the market that was quick that was very quick lots of like foodie stuff and crafty stuff um but and clothes and clothes yes yeah, so mum bought a like over over the togs top thing and then a hand towel for Christmas Christmas hand towel these are so good because you like just hang them over like a handle in the kitchen and then you can dry your hands on it we have heaps of, we have heaps of them at home and then we got some strawberries and some blueberries how healthy yes anyway it's really hot it's hot put it down the window Rachel and Morgan are on their way but they're not going to be here for like another couple hours so I'm going to go home and do some study have a bowl of strawberries have you tried one yet mum Mmm, that was good. I think I was going to supermarket and get some chocolate and then did some chocolate dip ones for dessert. Yeah, I don't think there's any chocolate on there. I think you want to get it behind. I left one ice cream behind last time I was here. Oh, somebody's eaten it. Dang it. It is 11.40. Rachel's ETA is 12.30 and Morgan's is about quarter past 11. But I think once they get here, we'll go down the road, find some lunch, catch up on each other's lives since we haven't seen each other. I haven't seen Morgan since July. So catch up on each other's lives and then maybe go for a swim and see where the afternoon takes us. And I think we're going to do wood-fired pizzas in the dinner. On the, yeah, wood-fired pizzas on the beach for dinner. We got these new seats from Costco. Oh, hmm. I thought they were fine. Oh. Rachel, I think it's like 10 minutes away. So I'm just gonna, I was doing some study, but I knew I wouldn't get through the next little block before she got here. So while well, I wait, I'm gonna read some of my book. I started reading this. I don't think I've told the vlog I'm reading this. I've been talking about it on Instagram. When I was in Fiji, Laura Henshaw was reading this. And so when I was in Fiji with Ash, I was like, oh my gosh, this book, apparently it's really good. So she bought it, Ash bought it, and then she read it and she gave it like a three out of five stars, whereas Laura said it was the best book she's ever read. Typically, we both love reading, but we have like kind of different taste in books. So anyway, I borrowed this off Ash and I am like halfway through, not quite halfway through. I don't love it, I don't hate it, but it's kind of just like, I don't know. I just don't really know where it's going like I, I don't read the synopsises of books before I start reading them so I don't know what I'm getting myself into so yeah I have no idea what's about to come <laughs> Hi. it's been a while I've been on this in a while <laughs> like a whole year so I'm literally shaking because I haven't stood up for like three and a half hours from driving how are you? good how are you? oh this is so cute reunited subway subway Subway. Your subway. Subway. With a view. We are about. Oh, why am I wearing sunglasses on the side? That looks. Like, so. <laughs> We're about to go down to the beach, and Morgan was just filling up her Frank Green with another bottle, and she dropped her Frank Green. Did you? And it like catapulted the water everywhere. So like, there's like water on the ceiling. Water right? on like the carpet and stuff, but there's literally water on like, the you ceiling. See the drops. Up, I can't reach them. 
If I can't see one get a camera, but there's like drops like obvious, dripping yeah. down the it's all over the mirror. No way. You sway. Anyway, oh we're gonna go to the beach. And yeah. I'm not gonna bring my camera because it'll probably get sand in it. <laughs> I was gonna mute this next clip and do a little montage, but um I think it's funnier if I just leave the original audio in. I have no context to offer, but enjoy. Kind of squid. Calamari. 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 Oh, yeah. Dude, that was like the best day of my life. Like, is it a rosé day? or? I feel like rosé would be more vibe, but Peter agrees. Yeah, what do you like better? Just get rosé. Are you sure? Yeah, get a rosé. I feel like rosé is a rosé day. I think we should get rosé. <laughs> <laughs> you get too expensive. I want. I'm going to get one. This is my vibe. Don't you get, get cheapest You though. get the wine that is like discounted the most so that you feel like you're getting an expensive wine, but it's like the cheapest one in the shop. Don't get like the cheapest like $10. Go for like a 12 to $15. But 12 to 15 discounted from like 24 Yes. Oh, this will be well. I feel sorry. It was probably No, that wasn't yet. It was me. <laughs> You caught it on camera. Okay, see you soon. <laughs> hey vlog! It was so cringe. Good. It's been a little while. Uh, we went down to the beach and did a little bit of sunbathing. Had some chats. Skill chat. Then we came back. Had some crackers and cheese. I would say cheese board, but it's like crackers and cheese. Also, bro, you can get in the frame. You're just like... <laughs> I'm really camera shy this time. <laughs> now, we're going to get some pizza from this little What's place. What's it actually called? Cool? Kitchenies. Where is Delicatessen oh, wood fire pizza. Oh, it's so good, man. So, Take your so word good. <laughs> Take your word for it. Right, let's go get some pizza. Yeah. Uh, this is my bestie. <laughs> He's dripping. Sharing is caring. <laughs> oh, that's okay. Do you harm? He won't. <laughs> Pumpkin, feta, kale, spinach. And goat's cheese. Something like oh, no, that. goat's cheese. Goat's cheese. And then this is just a margarita. Oh my gosh. Dig in. Okay. Dessert time. Oh my gosh. So good. We di chocolate dipped some strawberry that we bought at the market this morning. Got some ice cream. This is where we're staying tonight, guys. Sleep over the vibes. Good morning. Oh, look at my hair. Slay. Slay. Happy Sunday. Time check someone? What's the time? It's, it's like, like nine? nine? Five, five past nine and we had a sleep in till 8 30 and we're gonna go down the road now to probably Port Road Project if they have seats available. Oh, I hope. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, this I weather. I need a coffee. The weather is stunning. <laughs> Look at that. If, anyone, if anyone's been to Port Road Project, they'll know that when the sun comes out, there's like... Everyone wants to start Everyone and their mum is there. All failing, we'll just carry on to the next cafe. And the yeah, next. What's our second option? We should probably plan that. Like, um, um... We could literally come back and go to Blackies. Oh, oh everyone will still be watching the rugby. <laughs> Can we go now? Actually, actually. We need to go before the rugby's finished. Angry okay, guys. We, we go and we go. Right, what'd you get, Rachel? A flat white with a vanilla shot. Yeah. And, and uh... Cinnamon and chocolate scroll. Look at that. That's insane. What'd you so get? I got an iced latte with vanilla and I got a lemon and coffee seed as well. It looks delicious. And I got a three cheese scone and a hot chocolate. Me and my kitty apron. That looks ridiculous. Rachel has gone back to Hamilton and Morgan has gone to her parents' beach house and she's going to come back over later because I think we're going to go for a walk. I just cooked some dumplings for lunch and they are falling apart. Time to taste test because Leanne's kitchen, personally in my opinion, does the best like frozen dumplings. But there's a pork and prawn I'm pretty sure, which isn't normally my favourite either. I like chicken and veg. Hmm. That's actually decent. After we got back from breakfast or brunch, whatever it was, we went down to the beach. Well we actually we sat back here for a bit because we're trying to plan a overseas trip as a friend group next year so we're trying to figure that out and then we went down to the beach for like an hour and tanned and then went for a swim and it was like i went for a swim here in july in the middle of winter and it was cold but it was not as cold as it was today like today was actually like ice but we still went for a swim and then we came back and then rachel went home mm. these aren't too bad guys teleported i'm now back in auckland last night we ended up coming home after dinner which was it was always the plan we didn't get home here till like after 10 o'clock and then i was planning on going to the gym this morning at seven for the seven o'clock class with my brother and his flatmate i was like scrubbing to get into bed so i could get up and anyway i've been to the gym i'm now home i'm now unpacking my bag from the weekend away but yeah, today's Monday. Today's also a public holiday. It's Labor Day. So I am just gonna, I'm going to bring you guys along with me for today as well. I have, like, I have quite a bit of stuff to do today, but I feel like I'm just trying to cram a lot of things into today because I know that it's a day off. And like, since I work full time, 
these days are like I appreciate them so much more than I ever have before but I unpack my bag get changed have some breakfast and then I need to edit the video that will be going up before this I did a little bit of work on it yesterday so it's pretty much good to go I just need to re-watch it make sure it all makes sense add in like any little pop-ups and stuff and then I will see where the day takes me I do need to actually make time to intentionally rest today so we'll see how that goes <laughs> also i woke up this morning with a really croaky voice and i think it's just because i slept with my mouth open but i really hope that i'm not getting sick need to finish unpacking i didn't didn't actually take that much with me to be honest like did i wear everything that i took of course not who actually wears everything they take on holiday not me oh tv is sorted we're going for comfort today i also just remembered that morgan and i made a little tiktok yesterday which was very wholesome but i didn't post it yesterday because i don't I don't use social media on Sundays. Now I can actually do it and post it. It was a TikTok to this audio. And it was about us having like complete opposite <laughs> sense of fashion, but we still go to each other for fashion advice. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Dad's bought a new steering wheel for his sim, which you guys all love to see in the background of my office stuff. And he's cleaning up where it was worn down. Elkin Tara, cleaning the grease. With dishwashing liquid and a toothbrush. Yep. That's what they said to do. Nice. Well, I'm actually going out the store. Got myself some peas in a pod. I was gonna talk to you guys at the veggie garden, but the neighbour was over the fence. Mum, I got some peas. Got my peas. Oh, are you right? A bit small. Oh, no, too small. Rather I'll still eat it though. Oh, these are tasty. Mm, very tasty. I was gonna go and give you guys a little veggie garden haul, but then I got out there and the neighbour was um over the fence, like right on the other side of the fence and I got stage right and I didn't want her to think I was talking to her because I don't think I've spoken to her my entire life even though we live next to each other for 21 years anyway I have been doing some study this morning I just did my test for my like module that I'm currently in the works like in the process of doing so that's done and now I have like five little assignments to do before I can fully like finish this part of the course which I was kind of hoping to have finished today but I don't have the motivation for it and I'm not really in that much of a rush so I'm just gonna save it and do it during the week but I'm in the garage as you can see and my home gym is a work in progress I have a hope of stuff coming which is probably going to arrive tomorrow i was hoping it was going to arrive before the long weekend so i had like today to set it up but it, it just didn't work out that way which is fine while i was away a little package arrived this package is from kmart and i have bought some resistance bands for my gym but like long resistance bands so for doing like pull-ups and stuff and like shoulder activation i'm not really holding my breath on these they've got a light, a medium, and a heavy one. Buying them from Kmart was a cost-saving approach. From everywhere else, they were like three times the price. So I'm not expecting these to be the most incredible. It looks legit. The ASMR. Okay, that seems like pretty strong. Okay, I don't have a pull-up thing here yet, so I can't really properly test it, but it seems good enough. This one is the medium one. They're not very exciting colours. Oh, okay, that's quite firm. And the light one. Okay, yeah, that's, that's all good. Don't knock it till you try it, I guess. Pop-off came out. Just saved myself like a hundred bucks. But yeah, I'm hoping my gym stuff will arrive tomorrow, so after that's gonna be all go, but I think I need to spend a little bit of time in here today setting a few things up just to get started. On that note, maybe I'll sign this vlog off and you guys will see the rest in the next vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you made this far in the video, comment hmm, your favourite beach. It could be anywhere in the world. Comment your favourite beach and I will see you in my next video. Oh, okay. Come on, boy, let me go to the R16 rated Mave. <laughs> Three cheese! Oh my gosh. Taya is being on TikTok.